Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Foxman Plays Spelunky. I almost forgot what I was doing there. Yeah, I'm playing Spelunky. It's gonna be good. This is episode 99, and thus I have to dedicate it to the great one, Wayne Gretzky, number 99. It's a retired NHL or professional, I should say professional hockey player, because I mean, you know, he played in different leagues and stuff. Primarily the NHL is what people know him for, but I mean, you know, you don't always play in the NHL, but it, it could be your profession, you know. Whatever, let's, don't worry about it. First things first, I gotta pick a, pick a character. I'm gonna go with Fuzzy Wuzzy, because somebody's like, yo, you should be L with Fuzzy Wuzzy, because that'd be awesome. And I haven't played Fuzzy Wuzz in a while, so let's see. Um, I'm sure you saw episode 98 by now, so you know what I did there. I'm about to spoil it, so if you haven't seen it, get the heck out of here and then come back. But uh, yeah, so I beat Hell with uh, Meat Boy. So that was great. Um, that's why I named that episode Charbroiled, because it's just like going to Hell with... Yeah, that's right, Skeletor. Going to hell with like a wad of meat is just like basically you're you're gearing up to have a barbecue, you know, or something, you know, cook some burgers. It's hard to have a barbecue without burgers. I mean, you can do it, but you got to get pretty freaking creative, you know. Not like necessarily creative, but you got to get serious in terms of like, ooh, no. 2,000 for one bomb, it's, or two bombs, well, no, one bomb if I went from underneath, anyways, um, yeah, I just, uh, shit, oh, I'll use this pot, okay, Monty, get back, that was nice, that was nice, Monty, get back here, buddy, get back here, Okay, actually, you can go and just play there. But yeah, if you, if you have a barbecue without burgers, you gotta have some, like, gourmet as shit hot dogs or something like that. Some, like, really good, like, marinated chicken. And some, maybe some shish kebabs. I don't know. You gotta, you gotta have some good shit. And good salads, you know. Some people are all about the meat, but honestly, one of the best things about barbecue is just a really, like, good different salad. It's not just, like, straight up... Uh, Caesar salad, which is totally good too. Like I like a good proper Caesar salad, but um Yes, I'm definitely using a rope for a ruby and a potential other gem in here. Oh Fuck, I didn't mean to fall like that. Good thing. Nothing was in there. Anyways uh, I'm gonna kill you cuz I'm an asshole. Actually, I want to keep this rock with me. So yeah, yeah Caesar salad's great, you know, but I'm a huge fan of the Greek salad. You get some Kalamata olives in there some good, lots of feta cheese, some red onions, some cherry tomatoes, some cucumber, you know, get the Greek dressing on there. And you can you can do some marinated chicken as well. Ooh, that's nice. Um, I'm not gonna get the idol, I don't think, because this is level two. Always a shopkeeper in level two, and he's right there. Uh, what I am going to do is carefully tread <laughs> over all these spikes are through them. I'm actually gonna buy all of these bombs. And I know that seems like, well, why are you doing that? But now I can, I can, uh, I can bomb my way into gems and not feel so bad about it because we don't have to conserve the bombs we have for the black market. I mean, we do have to conserve them, but um, not so strictly. And I can kill this fool. Uh, however, just because I don't want to disturb them, I'm just going to go like this. That's the best way to do it. I know using a rope is like, eh. But, I'd rather play it, play it cool right now. Um, and we're making our money back. This is a pretty good level. Uh, I actually think I could get the idol if I go down to the left. But then again, it's only worth 5,000 right now. So, and I'll have to rope back up. I think I might just avoid it. I honestly, I just don't wanna, I don't wanna do the trouble. 
or, or bother with it right now. Okay, so, um, I forgot that that guy didn't actually get, um, set off when I threw that rock. There, I guess it was just out of range. Fortunately, Monty took the damage. I mean, not that I want him to take the damage, but he took it instead of me. And as well, he didn't fall on those spikes down there when he fell down, which was kind of lucky. Kind of lucky. So anyways, moral of the story is, I'm, I love barbecues. They're so cool, just being outside in the summer, nice foliage and the trees and flowers and the air smells sweet and you got birds and squirrels and all that and and it's just really good. It's like one of the things, you know, sometimes I'll be like, human civilization sucks, but barbecues are one of the things, and, and food in general, just like celebration and, and food is like, that's dope. Like, I'm glad humans have evolved to, like, enjoy food together and whatnot. It's important. It's important. Okay, let's do it this way. There we go. Um. Yahtzee? Oh, okay, that was already set off. I didn't even see it. We got our key here underneath, so I'm going to bomb... Hey. I'm going to bomb my way into it, and I'll put it right here so I get both those bits of gold. Oh, Monty, no. No. Okay, so here's the deal here. I'm gonna drop this bad boy down, carry Monty over to the right side. We're gonna have a look-see if there's any good gems and whatnot. Well, 1,500 gold. Better than nothing. It's actually better than a, an, an emerald. Uh, at least at this stage in the game. And this guy just get rid of him quickly thanks Monty for being a hard-headed son of a bitch oh shit 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 okay there we go we're just gonna avoid uh, that snake in general can I just toss Monty down there he should be okay or sorry the let's say spider darn it bad angle There we go, and I'm going to go this way, kind of drop on top of these fools, and then I can also get this gold without having to rope back up. There we go, that's nice, and I can do that. Okay, be careful here. Don't want to ruin a good thing by falling on some spikes, because I didn't take the extra half second. Okay, we got to watch that we don't bounce up into the spider. When we step on this guy. Good, good, good. I'll come back for... Oh, oh shit. Sorry. I'm really sorry, Monty. Okay. Now let's get you. I haven't seen any altars yet, which is... I mean, not a huge bummer, but... Uh, it's also not, like, super awesome that I haven't seen them. But, hey. You know what? We're playing pretty well. We've got a decent amount of money. Got a few bombs, and look it, I think that's our first crate, which I didn't realize we hadn't had any of until now. And I'm glad we got some ropes in that mofo. Um, this guy, I would like to kill. Um, so what I'm gonna do is this. Oh shit, that's not gonna kill him. That killed him. Get money from him and get that extra money. Guess we can get this as well. And since, oh shit, that ruby and that sapphire and all that looks pretty tasty. Um, I'm not gonna get this sapphire though, cause that would actually take two bombs to get. Let's just keep going. We have sticky stuff though, so we can get creative. Oh, I'll get this ruby for sure. And I'm probably gonna get this Oh, I'm gonna get all these rubies. Sorry, Monty. I should sacrifice them before I kill him. We do have an altar. That's nice. Um, okay, hey, where are you going? Let's do it like this so we can get the ruby and that good gold. Thank you. I'm gonna get this one as well. Just, you know, it's nice. And then, then we'll save a few bombs. And what do we get? Spikes just ah oh, awesome because I love to buy those early on. I don't like to have to worry about getting spike shoes, and and you guys know that I have trouble without spike shoes in the ice case. Most people 
will have trouble without spike shoes in the ice caves. It's just, it's too slippery. Okay. He's selling this guy, which... Oh, shit. I'm gonna buy him, sacrifice him, and get the Kapala. I know that's, like, a decent amount of money to be spending right now, but, um... And a lot of people will accuse me, like, oh, you don't sacrifice those guys enough. But it's like, you also have to consider, you know, like, other stuff. Okay, should I get this Emmy or this Emmy? You know what, let's get this Emmy. I'd rather collect money and stuff in a cool, nice environment relaxed and getting chased by ghosts and shit. No, I don't think right now I'm going to do diamond mining. One, I prefer to have a lot of... Ooh, there's another altar. I guess I didn't really need to buy him, but we can sacrifice Monty again here. And this is going to be good because I'm going to get a lot of gold from, or money in general. Oh, sh oh, wait, no, I can get back up. Um, yeah, what was I saying? Alter. Yeah, I, I, I can I can definitely watch this. Shit. Gotcha. Um I can sacrifice Monty here and then we'll have three of four sacrifices. And that's good because then I can Um hopefully when I have to set your kill myself. I can come back and uh, and sacrifice Monty on an altar that I'll get. Hopefully afterwards. Oh, there's a piranha down there. How much money? I have 50,000, so that's not like a huge amount, but it's still enough. And oh, get back. Don't take my money, you asshole. We're doing really well for, for health. I haven't taken any damage. Um, at all, which is really nice. And now I've got the Kapala, so it's it's great to have that kind of like double whammy of of not taking damage and having the Kapala. Because you could have the Kapala, but if you're taking damage, well, you know, it's still not going to necessarily save your ass because it only takes one dumb mistake like falling on spikes or getting into an endless cycle of Yeti swats or whatever it may be. I don't know. It happens. It happens. Anyways. Oh, yeah. Saying something about... Oh, yeah. Diamond mining. I don't have uh, climbing gloves. I... Okay. Do I want to buy these bombs? Okay. I... That frog is going to blow up. Oh, God. Oh, God. I was afraid it would piss off the shopkeeper if he got... One block closer, which might have been a possibility. I'm gonna do this, and then I can get, I can use like at least four of them to get gems and shit. Oh shit, that's not gonna do it. Fuck. But that'll do it. So I wasted one bomb, and that's okay though. Look at, we got some good money from it. Um, watch this bat and this. Tiki man. Skeletor coming alive? No. Okay, so I can do this. I can also put one there. Okay, these bees are coming. What about... Okay. I'm not gonna... I mean... I'll probably get the health just because it'll inevitably happen, but I don't want to get myself killed trying to get it, so... Maybe I should just avoid it altogether. Let's get this one. Actually, let's stomp on this guy so that he doesn't accidentally... Uh, or it wouldn't be an accident with him, but, you know. Who doesn't get us? Actually, that sapphire... I can't really get. Yeah, this guy... Still get- oh shit, oh shit. 
Okay, come in here so he can't get through. This is perfect. That's the thing. Bottleneck a uh, queen bee in like a one block space. She can't get through. Two blocks, yes, but not one. So we've got 13 health, which is pretty badass right now, actually. And we're making some good bank. That guy, I'm just gonna put him out of his misery. The major jabroni. Nice, and I guess I could get Monty as well. Uh, what what level is it? Oh shit, level two. I'll come back for Monty. Actually, I don't really need to, but I just kind of want to save him. Cause it doesn't. Oh shit! Oh shit! No, I'm not gonna save him. I don't think the black mark is here. I certainly hope not. That means it has to be on the next level. Oh my. Oh, I should, I should have got a sip of my drink. Um, okay. It is... Shit. I'm actually gonna use a rope to get up here just to make sure. It's in here somewhere. Okay, I'm kind of glad right here. I can see the little bit of green. Right on, brother. Let's get Monty while I'm here. Save one rope, you never know. Or, and, and one bomb. I meant to say bomb, but uh, it's good to save one rope. And let's just get out of here. Ah, I got that well-deserved sip of my drink. Uh, just one second. Got up. Okay. It's gone. A uh, frog just blew up. So I'm glad it didn't disrupt anything. Because I had no control over that or I was not aware. Okay, he's got a jetpack. So we want to buy that jetpack. Somehow. Budge. Um, okay, I'm going to do this gingerly. Do that. He's got a lot of stuff. These guys, I like, I don't want to kill these guys, though. Um, I am several thousand short of being able to buy that jetpack. It's probably like 30 or 32,000 at this point. I don't think there's enough. Oh, shit. Okay, he's dead. Good. I don't think there's enough freestanding gems and whatnot in here. Nice. At least we got the spring shoes. And you know what? I've beaten the game without the jetpack, so I'm not going to kill them to get it. And I've beaten it without the pitcher's mitt. And I don't need a cape. I would like a cape. So what I may do is just buy some bombs. And climbing gloves, though. Oh, shit. 12,000. I don't need even need climbing. Uh, you know, I'm gonna buy the bombs, and that's good enough for now. We're just gonna play it cool, and there's a chance we'll find some items. We also may um, come across a shopkeepers later. My first order of business is getting this money. I totally forgot my boomerang over here, and we're gonna smash this bad boy. Nice! So, I probably could buy some more gems and shit, but I'm not going to. There we go. Um, you know what? I don't trust this, so let's get rid of it. And let's go. Alright. I think it's really weird. I don't know if I've ever gone this long without taking any damage. Have I not? I don't... I honestly don't recall taking any damage. I know Monty got, took some damage in the... in the mines. That could have been me, but I mean, it wasn't me. Oopsies. Um... But, uh, yeah. So at this point, I'm not gonna get Monty. Because there really isn't much reason to on this level 
There's not much reason to do anything on this level unless I see like a good easy crate. Um, and this one looks semi easy. So we're gonna get it. It's ropes. I'll take it. I'm going to. S one, two, three, four. There we go. I wanna get some money. You know what? I'm gonna stay away from those guys. They're bad influence. And they also just try and kill me. Get out of here! See, you guys, you're like, oh wow, Fox is playing safe now. All right, I'm not yelling at my screen so much or punching it or whatever. Okay, that blew up. That could have been bad if, I don't know, I was near there or something, but I wasn't. I'm not in a, I'm not in a hurry. We're not in a hurry. Okay. We're just trying to scan the whole level before, or, you know, vert or horizontally before we go down. Because I've, I've got four ropes. I need to save some of them. So I gotta be looking out for the Moai, which is the big statue, the big head. None of those skeletons are alive. If I see the Moai, I will get Monty. Because it doesn't matter if we die trying to get him and we don't get him. That was literally, there's no way that Yeti could have fucked me over, so that's why I did that. I And I, I honestly didn't even need to do it, because it's not like I need health, but... It was a zero-risk situation. And since I don't really need the boomerang anymore, I won't be able to hold on to it for much longer. I'm just going to hold on to Monty, since he's right there. So we're going to stomp on this guy. Or watch out for the mines and leave <laughs> before we die. And so the Moai should be on this level unless I somehow missed it on the last one. But, you know, it's pretty big. And there it is, right below us. What I'm actually going to do... Uh, I was going to use a bomb, but no, I'm not going to use a bomb to get some gems at this point. Um, I want to save some of them for health and whatnot. Ah, shit. I can't really... Okay, now I can pick this guy up and throw him at this one. It's because I want to see what the shopkeeper is selling. If it, it's like a jetpack... No, it's a pitcher's mitt. Though, since I've got time... I think I may. Because one, if I get a pitcher's mitt, that's great. Two, I could just stand and make a lot of money. I can see the crate up there. So that's cool. I'll go for that. One more? Alright! So now I'm just gonna get some money. And, oh wait, yeah, I forgot it recharged. So if we get bombs, that's cool. I mean, I wish it was a jetpack. Money here. That's great. Listening to bombs? Okay. Wow. Three spins? All victorious. You know, I got uh, got two items and then I got some money, so... Oh, come on. Come on! I mean, this I actually didn't really want. I want money at this point, unless it's a jetpack or climbing gloves, maybe. Ah, I lost. Let's actually go get this, um... Whatchamacallit. That was a bit of a leap of faith, but I honestly felt like I could do it, and I did it. Okay, so we're gonna, yeah, we, actually, I'm just gonna drop that shit now. Get this, bombs, get this, ropes, get Monty, because we want him waiting for us on the next level to give us a kiss. We're gonna lose all this glorious health. This is some of the most health I've ever had, I think. Um, pretty wonderful, that. Okay, that guy's dead. This guy's gonna die. Okay, we'll put Monty here. And now we'll get some pots and stuff. Alright, not that one. We don't want it. No good for no one. And... Can't really climb back up. I want to save my ropes for more dire situations since we don't have climbing gloves or a jetpack. So let's just... Right as the ghost comes. Let's leave. Man, we were doing well for health there. That's crazy.
All right, sip of my drink. Like it's really, I'm, I'm, I'm not even so amazed about the health. It's just that I didn't take any damage up to this point. So that makes me feel like a man. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this guy to turn around again because, you know, I don't want to get blasted in the face. There we go. There we go. Gotta watch out for this chump. Boink. There. That makes me nice and happy. I'm gonna kill him. Actually, I should have kept that rock for, for like a, um, oh shit, Monty. What are you doing down here, buddy? Should have kept the rock for, for an alien ship. You never know. Uh, there's an altar, so this is freaking actually fantastic. This is exactly as I had planned. Oh, wait, actually, I should do it. Be very careful here. You know, I'm actually going to rope because I don't want to rely on my jumping up. I know I have spring shoes. Oh, shit, Monty, what are you doing, dog? And... I kind of want that idol. Oh shit! But uh, no, I. Oh shit! I forgot to collect gold or er, um, health. But yeah, I don't have climbing gloves, so I feel a little vulnerable. Oh no! I was gonna sacrifice your body. Okay, if I jump on this mine thing, no, I'm gonna go back up and over because I don't know what's next, with the closest thing to that little mine block. I also, <laughs> that was slightly risky, I'll admit it, maybe a little foolish, but, uh, alright, get out of here, we're good, we have 14 health, so, imagine if I didn't sacrifice myself and I just kept going for health, 18 plus, like, what did we get, you get 8 health, um, so that would be 26, plus I collected, a bunch more just from blood drops and shit. Wow. So, we're on the hunt for Anubis here. And this guy is a big butthole. Watch for the thwomp. Okay, you can just come back over here so I can jump on you. Please. Come on, he's coming over. There we go. One more. That's nice. Um, gotta watch for the thwomps. Watch this. Okay, so we did take some damage there, but that wasn't because of the thwomp. That was from the guy. So there's our first real bit of damage. There's Anubis. Shit. Alright. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna do this. Put that shit there. Okay. Let's get him up here. Come on, buddy. Come on up. I don't want to use too many bombs to kill you. I gotta watch for the thwomp. Shit. Oh, shit. Double shit. There we go. Alright. Thwomp. Watch the thwomp. I could get the thwomp to almost kill Anubis. But now. It's still kind of risky business. Alright, it jumped over there, which is good in a way, I guess. So, how can I get down here? And then there's the exit. Okay, that's not so bad. Skeletor coming alive? Nope. Anything good here? Other than money. I mean, I see money. Any crates, though? No noticeable crates. Let's just move on. Let's just move on. Nom, 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 nom. Okay, there is a crate. There's two crates. Well, let's get this crate for sure. Let's actually put it this way. So I can... Can I climb back up? Probably not. We got some more ropes though, so that's all good. And do I... I'm as much... Oh, fuck. I, there's two crates there, but... That would take at least two bombs. At least. 
So I'm gonna pass, cause I need some for the city. Oh wait, I can get this one pretty easily. Where's it gonna fall? It's gonna fall straight down. Before I go down there to collect it, I gotta see where the actual key hole thingy is. Oh shit, there's another one. Okay, I can get this one. Okay, there's the keyhole. You can get this one pretty easily. This one, it could be more bombs. Yes, thank you very much. There's another one with Monty. Um, kind of do. That would take a few bombs though. We'll see what's in this one. Because it landed here. That's not too far down. It's a camera. Uh, I do want to bring that with me. So what we should do is rope back up. Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. I'm gonna put this in its rightful place. We're gonna be careful when we go and get that camera. And then I'm pretty much gonna leave because the camera's hugely, hugely, hugely amazing in hell. Hugely amazing in hell. Hugely. Because it kills the vampires in one shot. So that makes killing Vlad and whatnot and all the other asshole vampires a piece of- oh fuck. I gotta get Monty on that altar. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I don't know if it's gonna- probably won't do anything and I gotta do this. I gotta do it while I'm here. That's a Matic. Oh, fuck. I would love a Matic, but the camera is actually... Ooh. It's hard to say. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, he's gonna be coming from the left. We didn't get anything. I didn't really expect to. But, uh, it might lead us into getting something more later if we get another altar. I don't know. It's just good to, to try things out. Explore the unknown, you know? Curiosity is, is amazing. Finally made it. All right, so we've got a few bombs. Should have enough to uh, do what we need to do here in hell. Uh, best way is probably this way. And yes, that is a thwomp. So. Since I am super afraid of it, I'm just going to try and kill it. Or do it like this. There we go. That's effective too. Yeah, this guy's being a giant douchebag. There we go. Kind of risky, but I had to do it. Where's the exit? I'm surprised I don't have a compass yet. There's a parachute there, don't worry, I see it, but... You know what? Let's just get this shit, regardless. Kill Anubis. And then we'll just be cautious. And this is great, actually. Fuck, 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 fuck! Okay, I didn't want to move too much because, you know, the camera's great. Oh shit. If you're holding on to it. Um, let's just go carefully. Watch for thwomps and shit. There's one right there. There's a bunch there. There we go. Watch for mummies. Oh, fuck. I just realized we've got, like, no bombs left. I probably should have just jumped on them. We'll get some... Okay, on the Anubis fight we've got coming up, <clears throat> hopefully there's going to be quite a few crates up top. We've got a few ropes. So, uh, I should be able to get up there, get a few more ropes, get a few bombs, and maybe we'll get some special items like climbing gloves or something. I don't know. Okay, I already see two crates, so that's great. There we go. Let's just get up here quickly. Spring shoes, which I already had, but whatever. 
Okay, no crates on the left, by the looks of it. So I won't go up there, because it means I'd have to use a rope. And I want to save as much of those for now as I can. Climbing gloves, that is honestly one of the better items I could ask for right now. Can I make this jump? Damn it, I gotta use another rope. But at least now it's not such a big deal since climbing gloves are a good backup. Compass, you heard me complaining about that one earlier. Now I didn't have one, surprisingly. Uh, and a lot of bombs. There we go. That's shit. Come on, you can do this. That's a huge relief for me right now. I guess, you know, I almost kind of wish I had to pick the Matic instead of the camera for the Olmec fight. But, uh, I don't know. Like, that was honestly a tough call because the Matic will break and it won't be helpful to me in hell. Where's this thing? Camera? Holy shit, man. It's a huge, huge lifesaver. Just in general, too. But, uh, you know, anyways. Get this last crate. There's a chest for us. I don't think there's anything else we're really missing, is there? Other than that golden shit up on the uh, far left, but... Let's, let's worry about um, beating up this stupid piece of shit. Um, I'm gonna go down the left side though because I think I can actually go down the wall on that side. In which case I guess maybe I'll get... No. Oh wait, I did get this money. Okay, never mind. I'm a big dummy. Yeah, this guy's gonna be coming at me. I'm just gonna let him walk over and fall down on him because sometimes when he jumps he hits you and he might hit me, stun me, and I'll get crushed by Olmec. So I don't want that. What I do want is to find where this guy is Namen, which I didn't do. So let's get uh, Olmec over to the left, because it's over to... It's right by that emerald, basically. We're going to use a few bombs. Hopefully not too many. Okay, I see the door. Actually, it's to the left of where I was looking. Shit, this guy's coming. Um, get over here so then I can do my business in peace and quiet, please. Come on. Okay, now I can go and do my thing. Okay, that's where we want to go. Careful. Um, let's put this bad boy here this bad boy here I need to save a few bombs for hell that's for sure and I need to save at least two for the final hell um, level of hell to kill all horse head and ox face or horse face and ox head I don't know what which which is the head and which is the face I'm your face I do, I do need to practice more of killing Olmec, like the old school way, without bombs and shit. But for now, I'm content to do it this way. Alright, baby doll. I'm gonna ride you down like it's 1999. Shit. I don't know if this is gonna work. Might not work. Okay, hey, watch this. There we go. I think that moved him. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Okay. It didn't quite work. Okay, I need to get him to, like, destroy some blocks or whatever. No, go back over here. Go to the left. Okay. There. I think he shifted one. That might be all I need. Come on, baby. This is gonna do it. There we go. Because I really didn't want to go back down and use more bombs to clear shit up. I mean, as long as you make it wide enough, yeah, we can make it work. You just gotta make them shift one block at a time instead of four. Horse crap. Anyways, drinky. Mmm, nummy. So, there's Vlad. 
All we have to do is get in there. And uh, we should be able to kill him pretty easily with this camera. He's dead. So we can get that and we can get this. Watch this. That was not too shabby. Uh, I... Oh, fuck. As much as I really hate using a bomb right now to get this... Like, come on, it'd be a shame to come this far. Uh, the only other shitty thing is I'm gonna have to use another bomb to get out of here. Yeah, that's kind of scary. I don't know if that's the real Monty or the fake one. It's the fake one. Definitely a succubus in there. Uh, I'm gonna have to use a bomb here. Oh shit. I just realized those little block thingies. Fudge. Um, they take up one. Damn it. I totally forgot about that. Well. This is going to be interesting. Okay, at least we can do that. I should have just gone back up top. <sighs> Got two bombs left. Hopefully we'll find a crate. Actually, we only really need one bomb. That's the cool thing. We really only need one. I wish... That might be the real Monty, but I have to save some bombs. I'm sorry. I, I really want to sacrifice them. But, uh... I think it'd be a bit foolish of me to. This guy, I'm gonna get. There we go. And... That's nice and calm. It's just... That's a fast-moving dealio. So let's move equally fast to get away from it. Here's the exit. Just gotta watch for this chump. Get out of here. I don't want to explore too much. If I can get through these levels without having to use any bombs, and I have two... Oh, that's great. There's another freaking altar. Oh, come on, man. Oh shit, I need that. Wish I hadn't dropped it, but I did. Um, okay, I see the way I've got to go. Let this one go. There we go. We can do this. It's nice and gentle. Don't rush anything. Uh, first, let's actually see this. that thing gonna fall? I don't know. Which way? I want to avoid the spikes. I can get over those two balls. Just wait for them to sink up again. And they will do that right here. Um, looks like I'm gonna have to go the other way. Unless I use one bomb right here. You know what? I'm gonna fucking do it. No more bombs to use. I gotta save one. So one I will save. Although, shit man. Okay, wait for it. Thank you, go, go, go. Wait, was that the third level? That was the third level. All right. Okay, whatever. This one's to you, Wayne Gretzky. The great one. King Yama thinks he's the great one. Okay, we gotta kill him first. Then we can kill him. Oh shit, oh shit. Those are my bombs. Okay, is that guy still alive over there? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Fuck, fuck off. All I want. I, why does he not get stunned? Like he was stunned. But not really. Okay, I gotta remember we've got the uh, double jump, but I'm still gonna use this here. 
gonna kill this guy just because I don't want to forget about him I'm going to hopefully destroy ah this is my that's my spot right there shit 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 actually what I like to do is go like that and then go like this and throw that shit he's right over there watch the blood come I don't think I got the blood maybe I was a bit too high there's the blood right on brother you want a piece of me uh, I don't want to use too many bombs I don't want to miss I don't know if he's he's roaming about anyways I don't have to be scared of lava men yes I know the amulet is like immune to lava and fire and blah 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 but like it's still scary you know there he is okay wait for it boom oh i'm sorry did i get you oh i got him again oh man oh you're a giant pussy you know that okay we got some troublemakers. Let's, uh. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? I mean, I want to get money, but fuck it. Let's just go. I just beat hell. What, what were you guys expecting me not to be L? Is that what you were expecting? Good job, Fuzzy Wuzzy! Yes! Huzzah! Okay, we can go through all this. We've seen it enough times. <clears throat> I, I'm happy. So there's another character that we've beaten hell with. This might not take as long as I originally thought. Beating hell with every single character. So that's the sixth one we've done it with, I think. Is that number six or five? I'll have to go back in episode 56. And then, wait. 56. And 94. And then 95. And then 97, and then 98. So that's five, right? Yeah, I think. Five or six. Hmm. I don't know. And that was actually the quickest one yet, I think. That's uh, under 50 minutes. Um, by my recorder, it looks like 48 minutes. I think the other ones were like 50 and 51 or something. Bullshit. I don't know. So what I'm going to do now is practice doing some more, uh, whatchamacallit, Olmec runs. I'll just do it with Mr. Indiana Jones here. Uh, or the, where I try and beat Olmec without using bombs and shit. So I, to do that, I'm going to start on the temple shortcut. Um, again, just so I don't, you know have to go too far to do this <sighs> okay let's uh, plus this is just good practice like getting through hell with minimal items but basically no items just like some bombs and ropes which are I mean still bombs you can consider some of the best items in the game really the only thing better possibly and it's debatable is uh, is uh, maybe the plasma cannon in terms of like just the fact that it's uh, go 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 you know infinite it's like infinite bombs the only problem is the kickback so sometimes it makes it worse that's why just a good well placed sticky bomb is sometimes you know preferable um, and then you can make arguments for the jetpack as well I think and maybe even the climbing gloves so, anyways, uh, get ready for this shit. Alright, he's gonna... Oh, shopkeeper's got a shotgun. Kinda just wanna fuck with him. 
This is not gonna be fun. There we go. We've got a brief period of time when the thwomp like moves. You've, it, it, you've got a brief period of time where it just will not move. There we go. Uh, okay, it's gonna come back. It's fine. This guy's gonna go do his thing. Shopkeeper's there, but oh shit, oh shit. I saw that coming actually. I don't know why I didn't really do anything about it. Boink. Oh shit, son. There we go. The, the other thing I like about starting at the temple, or the shortcuts, um, in this instance, the temple shortcut, but is that since I haven't gathered up a whole bunch of awesome ass items and oh shit, I forgot I don't have sticky stuff. That I don't feel so bad like making dangerous moves that I would otherwise be a pussy about, or like I'm more confident because like if I screw up, it's not a huge deal because I'm not really expecting to do anything like going to hell or whatever, so. I think it's it's beneficial in terms of like just me I don't want to say showing off, but just like going all out. I guess maybe that's the more appropriate way to put it. The most appropriate way to put it would be in your butt. Okay, these guys are gonna come at me. Whole oh, fucking gang. Open burn them south, and they're all gonna go in the fucking lava. I'm sorry. There should be an achievement for that. Okay, I'm just gonna do this. I mean, I don't need to save my bombs anyway, so let's just uh, use them to make the journey to Olmec a little bit easier. I'll bring you with me. You never know, I might need this weapon. That was level two? No, that was, oh, that was level three. All right. So. Let's see if I can get this shit down. That's a big gaping hole there, which is actually, you might think, kind of beneficial, but really it breaks up the consistency, I think. So, or, uh, and by a gaping hole, I just mean, like, gaps and shit. Okay, so I might bring them over here. Yeah. Let's do it here, buddy. Now let's do it here. Okay. Get ready, keep going. Keep going. Okay, one more. Get a rope up. Keep going. Keep going. Oh fuck! Um, so I actually went to grab the rope, uh, but I think that frog hit me off of it. That was, that was pretty much textbook. Except for, I should have been ready to use another rope to kill the enemies, like, right above me. That's, I, I sometimes feel like you might actually kind of just end up getting lucky, too, in that regards. But, I, I'm sure I could have avoided that. Um, I wasn't really paying too much attention to it. I didn't see that guy really coming down on me. But, uh, he did. He came down hard. Trusty juggler. Um, I'm gonna make this easy on myself because we got alligator man over there, and it's just, you know, easier to do it this way. Nice, 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 nice. Baby, you got me on the run. Doom, 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 doom. This is a good song. Sam Roberts. Oh shit. Okay, we're gonna do this. Uh oh. Oh shit. Okay, be careful. Get away. And there's the exit. Let's go. Smooth, Michael. Smooth. Oh, Spanky! So, is that the Leafs? Oh, I wasn't at the Leafs game. I was at the local bar near me um, called Hurricanes. Uh, not to do with like the Carolina Hurricanes or anything. It's actually named after a boxer. His nickname was like Hurricane or whatever. Anyways, so I was there with my buddy, and we're just chilling, hanging out. Like we hang out a lot and shit. We're good friends, I guess. And uh, so we. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know what's going on. Uh, this guy. This is gonna be a bit of a pain. Oh fuck! I'm dead. Ah shit. I got kind of distracted in my story. I wasn't paying too much attention. 
Really, it's my bad. Anyways. Oh, oh, oh. So we're there. Watching the game. And you guys know the grape lady? It's like a TV reporter. And uh, they're like doing the barefoot smash smushing or whatever you want to call it of the grapes. And she falls and like off this platform, right? Because, oh man, Anubis got killed on his own. That's badass. I think what I want to do is take his shit. I'll take his junk. Anyway, so she's... Is the exit on the left or on the right? Uh-oh. Okay. See, that's the thing with the... It killed, it killed the mummy immediately, but there was nothing else around for it to kill. Um, except I was the next closest thing, and the other things closer were on the right side of me, so it goes through me to get to them. That's why I hate using the scepter. Anyway, so there's the grape lady, and she falls down, and she, like, wins herself. You know, where they, like, you can't breathe and shit. And, uh, and she's, like, in pain. It's, you know, winding yourself isn't, like, a delight or anything like that. So, and she's just like, this is like, oh, 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 and you know how there are just some things in life you can do, and it just like instantly gets somebody going, um, no matter what, that's like, oh, there's a crate, yes, I do see the crate, no, I'm probably not gonna worry about it. Um, anyways, that's one of the things, like, I can do it no matter what, and no how we're- watch it, watch it, there we go. Yep. Oh shit, uh, that was not- uh oh. Okay, we can still survive this if this is- oh, okay, maybe not. Get out of here, wow. Okay, I could have done that better, but again, I get distracted when I'm telling stories, and that makes me do not so well with Spelunky. But, uh, yeah. I basically, we'd be watching the hockey game, and like, out of nowhere, I'd just start going, I'd be talking about something, you know, I'd be like, oh, you know, look at Castle Gold, da 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 he's doing so well, da 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 and then, then I'd be like, oh, oh, <laughs> and he just uncontrollably, he's laughing, and it, it was so funny, it was so funny, oh, okay, that was kind of, kind of close, close, uh, let's just go down this way, since I'm probably gonna die, if I'd don't. Nice, thanks for the money. Okay, okay. And Monty's at least gonna heal me up a bit. That helps. So yeah. But man, those leafs. It's a good game. If you're wondering like which one I'm talking about, um I guess that was the fourth game in the series. So they're playing Boston, Boston Bruins, and they're off to an early early lead, and then they kind of relaxed a bit and they fucked it all up and they let them catch up. And like and then they, Bruins were winning again for a bit. And then Toronto like almost immediately after scored. And it was lovely and all that bullshit. And then it stayed tied and they went into over uh, overtime. And like Toronto was like all over those fuckers. Like, and yet they still couldn't, couldn't do that shit. Um, they couldn't score. And then it just it happens. The Bruins scored an OT. Like they Toronto, I mean they had a lot of opportunities and shit. And they just didn't deliver. Like, oh man, it was like bombardment. 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 That's Simpsons episode. Anyways. And they still didn't they didn't put it through uh Rask and I mean, it's their fault, honestly, that they lost. They played really well, but, like, whatever. Whatever. This Bruins had, had very solid goaltending. Shit. Fuck. Um, I think I want to go... Oh, shit. Okay, he's dead. That is a very loud motorcycle outside of my apartment. I'm on the 16th floor, but you can hear stuff like you're on the first floor, basically. The sound just, like, funnels up. It's crazy. Okay, come on in here, you brony. Okay, we're gonna go 
I'm, I'm used, I'm not used so much, oh my god, oh fuck, I'm fucked. God damn it, that motorcycle. So distracting. It's not a motorcycle, baby, it's a chopper. Well, whose chopper is it? Zed's, baby. Who's Zed? Zed's dead, baby. Zed's dead. Anyways. Um. Yeah, what I was talking about, yeah. Hockey. Whatever. I mean, Toronto only has to win three straight games now to move on, but... Hey. If they do it, that'll be sh so amazingly insane. And the thing is, Toronto's the most expensive franchise in the fucking NHL. Which is hilarious, because this is the first time they've been in the playoffs since, uh, what was it? 2003-2004 season? And, uh, you know, it's a long time. Especially for one of these six original teams. Like, hockey is very much a Canadian sport. There's not really much denying that. So you kind of expect... Fuck. There we go, that'll do it. You kind of expect the Canadian teams to maybe do do not so bad. But, uh, I... There's not really any, any reason to buy shit, because I don't want to be using bombs, so let's just go. But yeah. So it's been great, because uh, I live in Toronto, right? So the, the Leafs are in the playoffs. Like, everybody's so going crazy and happy and stuff. It's wonderful. So hopefully they can do it next year. I mean, they got a pretty good team, but fucking FNUF and those gosh darn turnovers. Darn it, man. Hey. Oh, shit. Okay, he's done. He's done. Watch it. Oh shit, oh shit. I wasn't expecting Skeletor to do that, and he did it. I mean, that's what I get for not expecting. Um, what's the best way to go about this? I guess I can sneak on down through here. Hey, Monty. How's it go? Oh shit. Oh, come on, man. What's wrong with me? Taking. I take two damage from skeletons. Skeletons! They're in frickin' everywhere. I, they're one of the... That's... I never really realized it. There's skeletons on all of the levels. The mines, the jungle, the uh, ice caves, the, the uh, temple, and hell. Okay, let's do it this way. Fuck you. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's go here, buddy. No, nope, you're supposed to... Oh, fudge you. Yeah, let's do it here. Oh, right. He didn't move over one block. Okay. That stupid ass... I gotta kill... Ooh. He's got stuff. Can't really do anything. You know what I'm gonna do just for... No, I'm not gonna kill him. I want his shotgun. Oh, this is stupid. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's try this. Come on. I want to just, like, squeeze through there. Okay, this is actually good. Sort of. Except for Spitty McSpit. Sp oh, I couldn't make that jump. Yeah, it didn't look like I could have. Ah. Yeah, I'm gonna stop talking about hockey because clearly it is distracting me. It's distracting me. And kill you. I'm gonna get this guy to come over here and just feel the wrath of that tiki trap. Thanks. Thanks for feeling the wrath. I can't wait for Star Trek. Oh man, that's gonna be good. Yes, I see the crate. No, I'm not going to get it. Um, Shall we begin? I'm Benedict Cumberbatch, and I have a funny name and a funny face, but people still want to fuck me. The more they see me, the more they want to fuck me. That's my power. You're like, ew, Benedict. And then you're like, eh, Benedict. And then you're like, mmm. Mmm, Benedict. Mm. <laughs> 
I don't know, man. It's just like the first time I saw him in Sherlock Holmes, is like, who's this ugly mofo? And now I'm just like, all right. Okay, I can bear to like endure you, I guess. And now I'm kind of excited for Star I was always excited for Star Trek, but then I was like, Benedict isn't. I was like, all right, he's actually a pretty cool bro. He seems, he seems like a fun guy. And uh, yeah. So, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Plus, the, the first Star Trek was, was awesome. Like, a good action sci-fi thingy. A few too many uh, lens flares, but, uh, you know, what can you do? What can you do? You can't win them all. The lens, I don't know, the lens flares seems like a little try-hard to me. From, like, movie makers, like, trying to make it more, I don't know, badass or like real than it is. They're fake lens flares. They're not real. It's like putting fake grass on your lawn. Like, what are you doing, man? If, if, fuck. Dang, come on, man. Oh, shit. Oh, that arrow was from the lower one. Um, my bad. Oh, shit. I'm done. I'm done. I'm so done. Darn it. Benedict, you've been distracting me with your pecs. They're impeccable. He's, he's a pretty pale gentleman, but I guess a lot of you Brits are. Hey, that ain't a bad thing. You know, you got that porcelain skin. Let me touch it and we'll be good friends. Maybe we'll be lovers. Ay, caramba, get out of here. What do you call two scorpion dragonflies and a scorpion? I don't know. I I mean, that's not a rhetorical question or whatever. Like, I'm actually asking you. What do you call them? Like a gang? And it seems like you might call them a gang or something. Ah, oh, shit. This is not going to end well. Watch this. That ended well. I'm, I like thwomps. I remember the first time I think it was I got to hell and the thwomp killed me because... I just had no idea what it was. It's like, ooh, what is this thing? I want to touch it. I want to rub myself all over it and maybe pee on it and mark it as my own territory. And then it was just like, hey, dude, you must be new here. And it's like, yeah. And he's like, okay. And then he killed me. Fucking thwomp, man. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. There's an Watch this. Boink. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Get me out of here. Okay, I'm barely alive, but I am alive. I don't know, actually, barely alive would be one health. I've got two health, so I'm I'm thriving. That's right. I, you know, I showed that mummy who was boss. I was like, hey, mummy, I'm boss. It was a tight quarters. Using one of those fuckers to jump over, or jump over one of those fuckers in tight quarters, not easy. I mean, it probably is for you guys. Look at all those crates up there. Oh shit, okay. Come on over here. Sure, this is a good spot. Do this one. Okay, let's see if we can be successful this time, perhaps. I don't know why I'm carrying this pot. Shit, the- oh fuck off! Oh shit. Uh, oh, um. Brain damage. Wait, did I get crushed or. I don't quite know what happened there, to be honest. I mean, I'm sure it was my fault, whatever it was, but. I still don't know what it was. Shit, shit, ah, uh, that's not good. I don't know which way to go, that's my main problem. Okay, so we go that, hey, like a ruby. Oh, oh. Yeah, nice try, you fucking thwomp. My reactions are quick, like my tongue. <laughs> um, kinda gross, I know. Um, Anubis, you are a hoe. Shit, shit, shit. Fuck, fuck. 
Oh no. Okay. It worked out. It wasn't smooth. But it worked out. It worked out. I earned this scepter. I knew what I was doing. I knew it, the Tiki Trap would kill Anubis. So why not? Time for my drink. Mmm. Tasty beverage. Mmm. 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 Yes, I know that I need the head jet. For those of you who do not know, these guys are gonna die. Also, the head jet you get by sacrificing yourself on the level in the ice caves of the Moai, which is always either level two or level three. This is a shitty situation, and since I actually wanna save ropes instead of bombs, I'm gonna bomb my way down. Oh. I feel bad for the Thwomps. They used to be such a formidable, formidable foe. I was just like, oh my gosh. In the temple? Damn, I gotta watch for these Thwomps. And then, you know, every now, uh, now and again, one will get me, but not, not today. And what do we say? Not today. Some Game of Thrones up in ya. I'm gonna use the scepter on him. He's too weak. Uh, I am gonna go down this way, though, and just avoid that lava pit altogether. Well, sort of. I want to throw this arrow up. Okay, so that thing is done. Okay, get away. Kill the mummy, please. Don't come back. Don't come back. It didn't come back. Uh, yes, I see the thwomp. And I see the exit. Let's just go to it. Yippee ki yay, mother flower. You thought I was gonna say something else. I'm just gonna quickly check something before I press okay. Okay, we're good. And I gotta itch my nose. Ow. Ow, it's itchy. Somebody come itch it. Okay, I should probably just drop the scepter before I accidentally use it and get myself killed. It's probably for the best. Probably for the best. Becky. Okay, come on over here, Jabroni. Let's just drop it there. Get you up here. Come on. We can do this. Just. I didn't move back quick enough, and that was my fault. Oh, oh we're coming up on 1500 deaths. So here's what we're gonna do we're gonna call it quits. Once I die 1,500 times. So, there you have it. There you have it. Um, oof, this is gonna be fun. Fun, fun, fun for every one, one, one. Does that thing set off the air trap? I don't know, it was already set off, I guess. Uh, I can go this way. Gotta be, oh shit, we gotta watch for the lava man first. Let him dissipate. All right, that's good. Uh, we gotta watch, oh, hopefully another lava man doesn't jump up. Oh, oh shit, fuck, oh you can't, oh, yeah, you can't whip them. That doesn't make sense that you can whip them. All right, so this is uh, my last death before we call it quits for this episode. Um. You know, I kind of, at first I was going to be like, ah, you know, I don't want to, like, end this episode without doing anything. And then I kind of realized that we already beat hell <laughs> in the first run, so I'm not that sympathetic right now. Plus, I got other shit to do, man. I can, like, do my laundry and pick my butt. Uh, yeah, that was a good first easy level, didn't take any damage, and we got a free skull. Woo-wee! It's a good prize for a carnival. Uh, yes. I hear prayers. We got some extra bombs, so we'll think of a fun way to use them. Get out of here. Stupid thwomp. Oh, he's trying to get me. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. You can't get me. Oh, my God. Um, this is... You know what? Here's where we're going to use these extra bombs. 
Okay, watch this. I don't need much space to avoid those things now, which is kind of refreshing. Really refreshing. I mean, it's ideal to have more and you can still screw up, especially if you got climbing gloves. That's the case where I'd be like, oh, these climbing gloves, they're so sticky. And then they're gonna get me killed because I'm accidentally gonna cling to something when I didn't mean to. Yeah, let's get rid of him. Might as well take this boomerang. Mazel tov! Might as well take these ropes. And I might as well figure out which way I'm going. I'm going this way. This way. This way, Mr. Wayne. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you feel the wrath of my boomerang? It'll get ya. I'll get ya. There's an altar. Let's just put this guy to rest. Uh oh, that might not have been the best idea because he's not dead yet. Whatever, let's go. I believe I can fly. I believe I can join a boy band. Cause my voice is fucking magical. I believe I can fly. <laughs> forget how it goes and I know I actually can't sing so don't tell me that I suck because I know all right let's get this over Joe now this one now let's do this thing Ooh, that's an Emmy oh shit oh fuck I realized that he shifted over to the left because I didn't move back so then I went to go to the right but then darn it ah and I felt this earlier Olmec thingies were okay, but I still died. Whatever. So, that was episode 99. I hope you had a good time, and uh, we'll see what happens on episode 100. I don't know yet, because I haven't done it. So, yeah. 1,500 deaths, so that shit's insane. Yeah. Alright, well, anyways, I will catch you dudes and dudettes in the next episode of Foxman Plays Blunky, and until then, I say unto you... Peace out.